It's a piece of weld St. Louis shit. 16 gauge is what it is. All right, installing hydro today on um, Mitch's Z. How excited are you? You can't see it, but he's chubbing. He, he wears briefs now, so. But anyways, so we're making this little pattern here that we're gonna kinda go off of and then we'll adjust accordingly this one. But basically, we're gonna cut it out of the steel, mock it up, trial run, see if it fits, make adjustments, and go from there. Well, that's gonna be a motherfucker. You're gonna start it like that? Well, do what you wanna do. So test fit, cut out the bracket, mounting some bolt action. So we're going one solid piece, cutting out the center just as much as we need because we want to definitely have support here on those sides. Oh. I don't see it. That's fine, we don't need to do it too tight because that's actually, is, are you gonna ride it on the bottom or are you gonna ride, it, gonna on ride it on the bottom? Because I mean like, honestly it's just pushing on the seat and I don't, I think it's gonna hinder the actual seat. Cause you're Especially gonna cut some that. length, you're gonna round that, Especially cut some length it. off. So yeah, because that's gonna matter. And if this thing And then we'll trim down. that, trim that piece, trim that. And you'll have, right yeah, and I uh... I might do it at an angle where it comes back this way and it doesn't come towards me. Yeah. And I might not even take that bolt out. It's all preference. What, you know what you could do? Here's a thought, here's what you could do. So if you actually drill a hole like in one of them, and then like, so if you go like, check this out. So you drill a hole like here, and then you make like a Loose. cut, so and then a cut, and then you could always, just you could it always it. loosen it and, it and adjust to however you want it. Yeah. And if you really wanted to get fancy with it, you could do that. Because if you have it, if you have it there, like just centered there, no, I gotcha. and then only do the back, then you would only have to loosen the back bolt, and then you make an oval shape like this, and you could have it, and then as you find the way you like to drift, you could go, ah, I kind of want to move it yeah, right there. But then you'd have to keep that, some length on that bracket. Yeah, it's up to you. But I think being on the bottom is fine, I just need to get longer screws. <clears throat> yeah. So we can the boot right over top. Boom, boom. Yeah, and then it looks clean like that, yeah, because then you cover up that I don't square. Care about that. I think we can just get rid of that piece, because that's going to, the screws I'll use to hold this down, I'll just get washers to hold this in place. Mm -hmm. And I'll just think this this bracket here will take its effect over that. Get rid of this um, fucking piece of crap too. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, yeah whatever you want to do. I think you could try fine. it, and if it doesn't I think work, work fine. if it doesn't give you the support you need, you can always put it back on, and then all that. It's all gonna be covered up by that booster or the boot anyway. So. So this next step is: Do you want to cut the holes for that? This out. Okay. Let's uh. Let's pop these rockers out and take all this out and then see if we can't hit it with the trimmer. And because with the plastic, you could probably just cut it with dikes. That'd probably be your cleanest, easiest way to do it. Because if you do it with a grinder, it's going to get hot and it's going to start melting and folding. And so just, you'd want to cut it. It's going to get hot. It'll melt and get hot because it's plastic. So you got to cut it. All right, let's do that. What are you doing now? Swapping it from the left side to the right side. So we mock this up <laughs> when he puts it hydro here. His handle is really close to his wipers and his steering wheel. So he's switching the sides so it'll be more on the right side. <laughs> what the hell is on your playlist? <laughs> 369, bro, by Dan Hume. Mm -hmm. Nailed it. Alright, let's see what Oh, yeah, I see it's better now. You're away from the steering wheel. It's just gonna be, I mean, you're still kind of close to that steering wheel. That's kind of annoying. Oh, okay. What happens when you want to wear your Sparco drift gloves, bro? And, and, and they go all the way up to your ankle. They actually have a Velcro right here that straps through this hole. 
that's all I do is Oh, wow. shit. Yeah. yeah, that's pretty it's, fucking baller. That's some shit as hell. Sparko gloves, bro. Yeah. Gotta get some. Or I could poke this, this plastic piece right here so that screw goes in there so it sits a little oh, bit over. Oh, right. I think it, yeah. I think it's probably over. be better. Because if you mock it up right now, because it's that, that would be, well, if, let's see, if I get it over more, that's where it would sit. I think that would probably be better. Yeah. So, let's see. Because I have a drill bit that'll just put a hole right through that. that. You want to do that? Yeah. Good. And then we'll run it. These motherfuckers. I call these bugle bits. Yeah. Huh? No, I know. I got my bugle bit, bro. And then just remember it's plastic, it'll heat up and you'll get it stuck to my bed. For the win. Oh, that ball fits right in there. Perfect. Alright, so then yeah, now look how much it's So if you were to, like, because when you bolt it over, now you have the ability to slide it over more. Mock it. Mock it. We'll mark it. I like how that works for a track. And then, uh, so yeah, so check like if you were driving, let's say you're doing a scenario, right? And then you're going hard right, right? Lock into the left. Oh, like, it's kind of locked, so I can't Don't spin the steering wheel, just spin your hands, like, right? Because what you don't, what you want to make sure is that you're not fucking constantly whacking this motherfucker. I can still have some windshield wipers on in panic mode. <laughs> Boom. Alright, so let's mark this up, drill some holes, mount that, and then we'll see how. Uh, how it all fits up in that. It's bolted in, you drilled the holes and everything? Oh, God, you're so fucking tall. Yeah, if you get some seats and you don't get the rolly bar, I'll never be able to touch your pedals. Do you guys see this? Look at this. Oh, I can tell him. I can tippy toe him. Anyway, hydro is in. Here, you film that. All right, okay. So as far as your bracket, we cut it here, and we have enough room to do all of our shifts, right? So, we're good there. This is mounted. I actually kind of like where it's at. It's out of the way. So I feel like... Oh yeah. And, and if you pull that really hard, because you're going to have pressure on it, right? So, you pull it to here. Hey, those those bolts aren't on there all the way tightened down. They're just, but it doesn't, they're just hand tightened. Uh, okay. Uh, for That's the... It it's got, it's really firm though. I like yeah. this metal we use. Oh, and I like the placement. I think the placement's good. Your fingers will run right through here perfectly. I think that's... I really like where it's at. Oh yeah. I like it. I think it's gonna be nice. I think what we need to do is maybe take it off again and cut where the uh, seat is so we don't hit the seat and shit. Like, come, are you yeah. come across like this? Because the more you gotta remember, so if we cut this, we'll I'm probably yeah, I want to get rid of that edge just there, and then the uh, top edge, I just want to kind of smooth it around so that way I don't cut it like this way. Yeah, because you gotta remember the more you like. So if, are you gonna leave this back? Yes, part? I'll leave that back. Yeah. Okay. Because I was gonna say the more metal, the more support this I'm way, have. Yeah. You're gonna lose because this is so this is firm, I think, because it's resting. We'll, we'll find out once we get your seat in your car where how much room I'm gonna have. Watch it be in there. Funny. I really like the placement of this though, it's really nice. I feel like even if you trimmed it all the way up, you'd still have a good, like, you still have. Because this but is I think what I might do is go from this corner right here, and just go at an angle back this way. Like this, maybe? Like this way? Yeah. That'd probably be good. But like, maybe cut all along here up, you know? But it works. So, here, hold this. Okay. So like, we take the marker, just cut that completely and then cut from like here up to that corner right there and that leaves us strength coming from this bolt here and then it's all like and we can probably round it off a little bit but that'll take almost the entire seat out of play yeah well yours are big seats so if you had the bracing seat like that bracing seat yeah it'll be it'll take all this like, yeah. but other than that i mean the plastic it's fitting in there nicely i can actually access the bolt from right here and then show where you trimmed. You had to trim on the inside of that plastic. So, so yeah, like this is trimmed. I don't know if you could see it. This is actually cut. Yeah, um, they can, you can see that. Probably, probably, probably about maybe like this 
this much. It's not easy to go down. Yeah, about an inch. It's not an inch. You can see from right there. Oh, there you go. Yeah. So that's all trimmed up. So you trim that up and you slid it through the bottom side and then just mounted it that way. So that's probably what I'll do with mine. So if you can't tell with that hole right there, so I can get it closer, I cut for a hole right here. Oh, for that? Yeah. So the bolt is sliding. Yeah, yeah. yeah. And then. Pretty easy. Yeah, it worked out well. Yeah, yeah. So we'll do the same thing to mine more than likely whenever I get mine. But I do like, I really like the placement of this. It's, I was worried. I'm gonna mock this up. I'm gonna drive it from Southfield. Yeah. 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 Yep. 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 Cool. Um, and then all you got left is to put all that shit back on. Yep. Tighten that up. Tighten that up. What the fur? <laughs> it looks clear, and there's probably a purpose for it. Who knows? I don't fucking know. Oh, console's back together. Hydro's in. You trim the sides. Still got to clean. Oh, it's nice and flush now. Sand that up a little bit. Here you want to show it from that angle. Nice and firm. It still hits the seat just a little bit. The bracket does, but I think but when you put your race seats in, yeah. it's still, it's I can tell you, you're not going to be able to drive my car. It Ooh, it's cutting it. It doesn't go much further. Unless, so you can test the hydro in my car, but as far as seat wise, I'll just have to order seats then before you test the hydro. Other than that, I mean, it sits really nicely in there. It's, it has barely any play. And I mean, it's not like I'm gonna be pulling it hard or anything like that. I mean, it's not going anywhere. So that's yeah. good. And I'm going every gear with that bracket. Boom. That fits nicely. I like it. Nice. Yeah. 